Welcome back into Double T Insider. We are just days away from opening weekend of Texas Tech baseball. I'm Taylor Peters here with head coach Tim Tadlock. Coach, you guys, of course, hosting Oregon this weekend. What do you like about being able to host a team like that that comes from a conference like the Pac-12 that's so dynamic and so deep? Well, Coach Horton and his team will present a lot of challenges. He's got one of the better pitching coaches in the country, and Coach Horton learned under Augie Garrido. So we'll definitely have some challenges there as far as the bunt game and all that stuff. And uh, Coach Dietrich does a good job with their pitchers. I mean, they can always locate a fastball. And uh, but you know what? Our guys, our guys are excited about the opportunity to go compete this weekend. I know that you don't like to talk about players in particular, but can we make an exception for a guy who's a preseason All-American, arguably one of the best players in the conference, in the country, and that's Josh Young? Oh, I think so, as long as you, <laughs> as long as you recognize Gabe Holt hits in front of me. I mean, Gabe creates a lot of fastballs for our whole team. And, uh, so I think people you know, forget about the little guy that gets on base and kind of sets the table for everything. But Josh and Gabe both are guys that show up at the ballpark every day. They love to compete. They love to play. Uh, and obviously, they're, they're guys that want to be great at their craft. This isn't just about being great at college baseball. They want to be great at their craft in the long run. And that's a lot of fun to go to the ballpark with. When you lose a couple of guys in your lineup, like Michael Davis, who did so much at the plate, and, and Zach Reams, what do you enjoy about an opportunity to see some of these young guys step up and be able to kind of, you know, put some guys on base like Josh? Well, I won't get ourselves in trouble. <laughs> we got to mention Grant Little and Cody Farhat also. Yeah. And hopefully we're not forgetting anybody else in there. Those guys had a lot of awful, really good at bats and mm -hmm. played awful good defense for us. And um, I, I got to go back to the question. So, <laughs> you know, it's um, it's exciting. We we've got a group of guys that um, are very talented, uh, that enjoy going to the ballpark, like working at the game, and uh, I think they know, you know, that there's more there for them. So that that should continue as far as the work ethic. It seems like the bullpen's really deep this year. Tell us about some of the new guys that you guys have. I know that there's several freshmen that you could mention. Yeah, the bullpen really has a chance to be really dynamic. It really does. There's some real power arms down there. There's some guys with some angle in Taylor Floyd, um, Ryan Sublet. Those guys are two guys that you know should give guys problems. Um, right now, Kurt Wilson and John McMillan, those are two guys with power arms. Uh, that can really just say, hey, man, you, you know, you're going to have to make an adjustment to hit me. And, um, and then Clayton Beater is a guy that redshirted last year, medical redshirt out of Birdville High School. And he's come on really good. I, I hate to start mentioning names because we <laughs> leave somebody out. Right. And there's a whole host of left handers in there, and Dane Habeman and Kate Farr, and Noah Huerta, um, Ryan Kesey out of Temple Junior College. So. Um, and I know I'm leaving one out there, and, but the bullpen really has a chance to be our strength. You've talked a little bit about this idea that you've kind of discussed with your team, don't take the cheese. What does that mean, and, and why is that something that's kind of resonating with this group? Yeah, I heard Josh say that the other day, and we hadn't <laughs> talked about it in so long. It was something we came up, you know, across in the fall, and it's just really a one-day deal where we shared it with them, and Mm -hmm. um, really what you're dealing with there is expectations and you're dealing with you know everybody saying you're going to be this and all that and really just trying to deal with what's between the mind and between the ears and trying to dominate the mental side of the game. Just stay disciplined and focused. If your team's anything like you then then I can imagine. Well we, that way. you know <laughs> it, it's it's an elusive deal I mean you know to to try to play baseball in the moment for nine innings it's elusive and our guys understand the challenge of the mental game and um, you know, what you hope is, is they, you know, they play together and they help each other try to stay in the moment. We're excited about getting a chance to see your team for the first time this weekend. For Coach Tim Tadlock, I'm Taylor Peters. Don't forget to head on over to TexasTech.com for scheduling and ticket information.